remember, when you subscribe to our channel, click on the red subscribe button and be sure to ring the bell so you get notified every time we have a new video. Thanks again. Mixed media girl, what are we gonna do on these aluminum? What are these called? So cool, they're alu rims. Okay, so these are alu rim. Yeah, it's a new company I've been working with. They're just super duper cool. These pe people have asked me, like, aren't those just pizza pans? But they're not, okay? Not all totally aluminum not. is the same. No, totally not pizza These pans. These are, like, really durable. You can use either side. The rim is specifically designed for painters to use, right? So you don't get those resin drips that you will normally get on the bottom. You can maintain your design. It's... Um, cool. archival or whatever you know like it's just these are super friggin cool but i love these so i saw in yours you you had you had some texture in there. yeah so on my last one i did the resin in there and then i put some stones in afterwards and i still do i'm going to put a clear coat over it okay cool. um but these are fairly deep like yeah. you can actually put a decent amount in here you don't have to you could also use other forms of paint like these are great for alcohol inks Oh, also, cool. you can do an acrylic pour in there and then seal it with resin later, you know, and like I said, you can use either side. Super cool. So cool what products. do you challenge us to do? What should we be focused on when we're doing this? What's your thoughts going into it? We are going to make a super cool, like semi geode inspired resin painting in these. And cool. yeah, and we'll see who makes the coolest one. Nice. I think we're in trouble, Mitch. <laughs> yeah, I Guys, agree. Guys, let us know. Have you seen Mixed Media Girl? If you haven't, go check her out. Press subscribe. Ring the bell so you get notified every time she has a new video. Thanks again. Let's get started. You yeah. ready? So uh, we'll need about, let's say, four ounces for each of these. Four and then eight. another couple ounces for that. So just do like 10-ish. I'm mixing here with a paddle mixer and a drill for two minutes, taking time to rub the edges and the bottom at slow speeds. So what are you using? What colors? I'm going purples. Yep. So I'm using, this is the uh, violet, and then I'm going to use the white, and the white I'm going to mix it with uh, the interference. interference purple. And then I'm going to use this one. I haven't used this yet. And then the copper. I think that will be epic. We'll find out. I'm going to use black opaque, cotton candy, and gold. Well, that's gonna be interesting. Mitch, what are you using? I'm using blue-green, interference blue, nice. real teal, and white base. Guys, have you met the rock star? This is Johnny. Johnny, what's your channel, man? Uh, it's uh, youtube.com slash Johnny Farrow. J-O-H-N-N-I-E-F-E-R-R-O. <laughs> Johnny Farrow can play to your heart's desire. If you haven't seen him, go check him out. The man has massive talent, and I can't wait for our upcoming collab. We better keep it a secret for now. Yeah, yes. we're keeping it under wraps. Yes. Bonus content coming up. If you stay to the end of the video, you'll be able to hear Johnny Farrow's song in its entirety. Right on. Nice. Guys, we come in Artisan Summit. Marcy, Johnny, I'm going to be there. Mitch is going to be there. Artist Till Death, Burrow Hunter. So many people Everybody. are going to be there. Home Paul's Talk. Toolbox, Home Talk's going to be there. We're going we're gonna to see American Builder again. Yes. It's going to be fantastic, guys. Uh, Rhonda Draculis is coming back yeah. out. Yeah. We're going to have a blast. It's going to be craziness. So visit us at artisansummit.com. We will see you in Vegas 2020. Look at this, guys. Yeah. This is the violet. Wow. That's the liquid dye? Yes. Ooh, so Dang. pretty. Now, this is the white with the purple interference. Interesting. Ooh. Oh, this is rad. Look at this gold. It's got like, it already has like really deep texture in it. Now, since we're kind of doing geode style, I like to sort of go in lines. This is kind of my main color. Uh huh. So it is a little difficult to stay inside because I'm so used to just going right, over. Right. Right. So you have to like, you know. Well, you could always work clean that rim too. Oh yeah, absolutely. And especially while it's wet, it just wipes right off. Uh huh. Perfectly clean. Then now I, I noticed go... we didn't sand these or anything. You don't need to. It's no. been sticking good for you. Oh yeah. Awesome. Yeah, you don't need to do any prep. If anything, you might want to like wipe it down with some alcohol just to get any like fingerprints mm -hmm. off or something, but. Yeah, you don't need to prime them or anything. Marcy has an album. What's the name of your album? It's called You Got This. You Got This? Nice. Like, yeah, that's the best name ever. <laughs> you can, at this point, if you want, move things around. You can use your heat gun, your torch. I'm going to just play for a second here. I'm just going to move this around by myself. All right, so I'm going to just go, Marcy. Yep, go for it.
I love because it's thick. It's really kind of moving for you, just making all these little strings kind of realistic looking to me. Okay, I'm gonna add some gunmetal mica flakes to make these rocks look a little bit more real. Oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. That looks cool. Just the one color looked a little, in this busy thing, it just looked a little too undone to me. I really like watching you do yours to kind of get that inspiration. I think, I think that's what's so valuable about watching an artist because you'll, you'll trigger me to think about things, but just, I would have never thought to do this on this kind of an object. And yeah. it's so fun, like super forgiving, like no mess. Doesn't take a lot of material. Yeah. And we, we picked this up. Guys, did you see the last video that we did where we created geodes? Wasn't that fun the last time you came to Oregon? Yes. That, that was like was a year crazy. ago. Uh, yeah, that was like last September or something. Yeah, crazy. Wow. So guys, go check out the video. We'll put it in the link below. And we just pulled these same things we got at Joann's, oh, I, I think. Paper. So when you're done, just take your paper towel, squeeze it up in your hand, and you're ready to rock. That? How did you do that? <laughs> Got mixed media, girl. So guys, let us know in the comments, what'd you think of this video? What'd you guys learn? Did you enjoy it? I learned a ton from this girl right here. Do you learn a ton from her mm -hmm. every day? Mm -hmm. Mitch? Mm -hmm. I did, I did, I did, I did, I did. That was awesome. <laughs> I made Flat Earth over here, Flat Earth Society evidence. <laughs> All right, well, what do you think? You love it? Yeah. I like the colors, man. That's, that's, that's a wall really hanger. cool. I love this. So I'm definitely that going violet. home with that. Yeah, violet, cool. the violet translucent. Guys, right. visit us anytime at stonecoatcountertops.com. And until next time, you, you got, got this. this. We'll see you on the next video. <laughs>